Testing, one, two, three, over. How's it going guys? Jeff Benjamin, 95 Mac. The walkie talkie app is now live in watchOS 5 beta 2. And in this video, I'm going to show you how it works. So all you need to do is launch the app. You will need a recipient that is also running watchOS 5 beta 2, by the way, but there you'll see the splash screen of sorts, a fun way to talk to other Apple watch users. And if you scroll down, you'll see a list of your contacts for adding walkie talkie recipients. So I'm gonna scroll down and find someone who I know is running the watchOS 5 beta 2. And that is none other than product manager at nine to five, Greg Barbosa. He was gracious enough to put up with my annoying testing request. Uh, and he was a good sport about it. You also will find contacts mirrored in the walkie talkie section of the watch app on your iPhone. So if you wanna manage your contacts there, you can do so. You can swipe to delete from either there or directly from the walkie talkie app on the watch to remove contacts. And you'll also receive a request that looks like that. Once you accept the request, then you'll be able to correspond with your walkie talkie recipient. To add additional uh, contacts, all you do is tap the plus button at the bottom of the contact card list and there you can add additional contacts. And if you scroll in the opposite direction, you'll find an available switch, which allows you to toggle walkie talkie availability on or off. Handy if you're in a situation where you can't be bothered. Now to turn it back on, obviously just turn the switch back on, or you just simply tap one of the contact cards and it automatically comes on and switches over to the talk screen. Now the talk screen is, as you might expect, where you initiate your conversations. And this is really a very simple way to initiate con conversations with the walkie talkie app. It works just like a walkie talkie or one of those old Nextel phones. So very simple application. You can use the digital crown to adjust volume and you hear your friends directly from the Apple Watch speaker. You can use AirPods as well, uh, but you can do everything directly from the Apple Watch. So let's test it out. Hey Greg, are you there? So you wanna tap and hold the talk button for the duration of your message and then release to send that message. Hey Jeff, I am. Messages you receive will be automatically received. How do I sound? So you can see it's pretty quick. It doesn't always work that smoothly, but it's just the second beta and I'm impressed. Do you have anything you wanna to say to the people? So again, as you can see, living up to the name of the app for sure, just like a walkie talkie. So as you can hear, sound quality is pretty decent coming out of that Apple Watch speaker. We're actually connected to Wi-Fi now, but I'm gonna force a cellular connection and then test it and see how it works. Testing, one, two, three, over. So that was sent via cellular, and let's receive a message. Coming in loud and clear, Jeff. Coming in loud and clear. So you could technically be out anywhere and communicate with walkie-talkie on Apple Watch. Okay, send me one more message in about 30 seconds. You got it, I'll wait a minute 30. So now what I wanna do is force close the walkie talkie app and open up another app and see what happens when I receive a message. You'll also notice that there is a shortcut above every watch face for walkie talkie, sort of like its own complication for walkie talkie above every watch face that allows you to quickly get to the app. So in that instance, Greg went ahead and sent me a message. Even though the walkie talkie app was closed, I was still able to receive that message just like that. Doing great, man. Appreciate your help. I guess I should do one more test with AirPods now. So give me one more second. Okay, so now I am connecting my AirPods. You can see they are connected. And now I'm going to initiate a conversation with Greg via my AirPods using walkie talkie. Okay, now testing with AirPods, what's up? Hey 
So you can't hear that well, obviously, because it's going through my AirPods, but it works really well. So just imagine you, you know, out running or something, you don't have your iPhone with you, but you have your Apple Watch with LTE, you have the Walkie Talkie app, you can quickly correspond with your friends using Walkie Talkie, using your AirPods, and really, it just feels super futuristic. I don't know about you guys, but I really think this is a cool feature. What do you guys think? Let me know down below in the comments. This is Jeff with 9to5Mac.